simulation of snow and wind lows on a gable roof. Initial data, there is a hangar model with a metal frame and a gable roof. In the properties of the roof model, you must specify the interpretation method, proxy object for loads. Snow will be modeled by a load distributed over an area. The parameter through proxy objects in the load properties dialog box must be set to the yes value. Now let's create the wind. We choose the modeling method, define manually. We create a second wind in the direction of 90 degrees relative to the OX axis. Then we highlight the model of the roof by picking it with mouse cursor. Select the wind load function. Select from the list of winds the wind in the direction of 0 degrees. Enable the option, redistribute loads on bars through proxy objects. By switching the load case filter, we can see the loads from wind and snow alternately or simultaneously. Let's use the wind loads on the roof function again. This time we choose the wind in the direction of 90 degrees. Do not forget to enable the option of redistribution through proxy objects. Now we have three sets of loads, wind 0, wind 90 and snow. Go to the tab of the ribbon analytics and select the function create meshed model. In the proposed dialog, the option distribute loads on bars through proxy should be selected. Upon completion of the dialog, the calculation is performed using the finite element method. As a result of the calculation, the loads applied to the roof slopes are redistributed to the system of bars. We can observe the loads linearly distributed on the bars in the calculation model. We can also inspect their values with a colored mosaic. 